Yo, yo, it's your boy Dub, back with another dub episode of this music, life, whatever. One of the main questions I get asked most of the time is, man, how did you come up with the name for this band, Predator Dub Assassin? I'll tell you the story. Many years ago, I played in a ska band called Inspector 7, a band that exists in some form to this very day. My good friend Giuseppe Mancini had a roommate at the time who had this habit of giving everyone he came into contact with these weird nicknames. And somehow, even before I was in the band, he stuck me with the nickname The Predator after the movie character that had dreads. It's that simple. Pretty obvious, yeah? Flash forward five years. I was going to be leaving my post as guitarist of Inspector 7, and I knew that I wanted to form a pure, more roots reggae band. Ska too, but more focusing on the reggae. And I knew that I was going to be drawing members from various bands here and there. So I tried to think of a name that might support the fact that the group was kind of a collective. And the first thing that I came up with, I knew I wanted to say do dub something. And what I came up with was dub militia. That's what I finally settled on. Now, I started rehearsing with the band. Everything was going great. Writing songs. Then 9-11 happened. And it was because of 9-11 that we wound up doing our first gig. It was at the legendary Continental on the Lower East Side, a place I would play all the time when I was in Inspector 7. The gig was on October 30th, one month after 9-11 and the day before Halloween. One day I found myself at Giuseppe Mancini's house telling him about the upcoming gig, and he got a phone call. And as he was talking on the phone, I could hear him tell the person, yeah, I'm hanging out with Preddy right now. The name eventually got short to Predator, P-Dub, Dubby, and all this other. But back to the story. He's on the phone telling the friend, Yeah, I'm here with Preddy right now. He's telling me about his new band, Predator Dub Assassins. Then he holds the phone, looks at me, and says, That's the name, right? And I look right at him and say, Yeah, yeah, that's the name. And I just ran with it. I literally ran with it from there. And we told the folks uh, for the flyer for the gig that was the name of the band. And ever since then, that's been the name I've been making music under, Predator Dove Assassins. Very simple tale, not very exciting, but hope you enjoyed this story. Hey, share it with friends, man. I'll see you guys next time. Music, life, whatever.